ideas. I was talking to a friend and I recently started thinking, what is the government? The government is more like a modern, realistic, political or economic version of God. And I don't mean to offend any Christians out there, but to me, God is just an idea humans created for hope. It's not a bad idea. It's just very stupid. Back on topic, though. The government is also just an idea. As as realistic and physical as it may seem, it is only an idea. Take the law of... Take the law of, like... It's against the law to kill someone. Take that, for example. It's only an idea. That is only an idea. A law is just an idea. It may be written... But it's always going to be an idea. Anything we create starts out as just an idea. It's still an idea. Even even if it's made realistically, even if it's made physically, it's still an idea. The idea of that thing existing is just an idea. Cars. Cars are real. Cars are physical. The idea of a car, though... That's just the idea. The concept of a car is just an idea that someone made into living real world. The law, which I was talking about just earlier, the law of like the law against killing someone. I'm not saying it's right. I'm not saying go out and do it because it's not. A good thing to do. I'm just saying it is only an idea. Getting in trouble is only an idea. Doing the wrong thing is only an idea. The government is only an idea created by the people, by people all over the world. Governments, the ideas were created all over the world by people who wanted something to give them hope. In times of crisis, when when the in times of crisis when everyone doesn't know basically what i'm just saying is it's just an idea ideas are only made physical well no ideas are ideas the concept the concept of an idea can never be physical, but the idea itself can be made physical, but it never stops being an idea. Before government starts, before government ever started, humans, the regular society of humans, individuals, everyday individuals, were the advanced, the most advanced race. But they created the government in order to give them hope. In order to look at someone higher than them that could help them in a situation when they were helpless. If they didn't have someone there like that, who knows where they would be. That's the most advanced race. We can't handle everything. And the things we can't handle only make it worse if we don't have anyone higher to look look at for help. That's when chaos starts. When someone higher than you can't help or there's no one higher than you and you don't know what to do, you go crazy. You start rioting, throwing fits in streets, and people join you because they don't know what else to do. They riot with you, destroying everything in their path because they don't know what else to do, and they become savages. Hungry, angry savages who feed on the misery, the happiness, and all the emotions of others. 
try to break them down with them, get them to riot. That's what we do as humans. We push any of our emotions onto someone else, making them try to make them feel what we feel when they're hopeless, when we're hopeless. That's why government was created. It's not the best solution, though. As much as it helped over the hundreds and hundreds of years since it was created, government is not the best idea out there. That's why God was created. In order to have someone higher than government to look at for help, someone who doesn't even exist, something that doesn't even exist, an entity out there, an idealistic entity that supposedly grants hope for others. It's false hope. As real as it may seem, it's all false. The government, hope for the hope with the government, that's all false. As, as secure as it may make people feel, it's all false. So once again, I don't mean to offend any Christians or any idealistic people out there. I don't mean to offend any of you. I just kind of speak what's on my mind. Like every day I have since the government was destroyed. And all I have are the corpses of my dead wife, brother, and dog. What I look at while writing this. And I think to myself, How fun would it be to go kill some people?